From the Metamorphoses, Book One, Ovid. Scarcely had the Creator separated all things into their finite bands. When the stars began to blaze in the whole sky, which had been for so long buried in blind darkness, and so that no realm of the universe would lack life, he made the firmament to hold the bright constellations and the gods and goddesses. The waves gleamed with swimming fish. The earth had its wild beasts. The gusty air its birds. A holier animal with a mind capable of loftier things, who could be a master over all the other creatures, was still absent. So man was born. Either the creator of all things made him from divine stock, so as to found a better world. Or else perhaps the new-made earth, so recently separated from the heavens, kept some essences of the familiar sky. That earth, sprung from the creator, mixed with rainwater, was molded by Prometheus into the appearance of the gods who governed all things. And while all the other animals looked down upon the earth, he made the face of man to look upon the heavens and to hold his face up toward the stars. And so the earth, which once was crude and without form, took on the unknown shape of humankind.